All right. Um, I guess we can go back to our old area. We have the, like the. Well, the map's not as big as as, it, as the others, right? But we have the. Uh, north and southwest that we can explore. So I say let's go. Uh. Wait. I say let's go southwest first. Also, these seahorses are kind of cool. Everyone to sleep, huh? Everyone to sleep, huh? That's right, Ignis, you wake up. Alright, I'm... So I'm thinking... If we could go south... Southwest first. Oh! Convenient, there's a town. Where is this? Toko. Two chests, five items. Ah! Mercy! There's nothing here of value, I swear! Alright, weird. Spring, spare me! Alright, weird. One of the soldiers dropped the, this banner after they attacked our village. It bears the crest of Argus. King Argus? That can't be right. Beyond the desert, far, far to the west, is a village with uh, eccentric people who claim to be descendants from the ancients. Whatever that means. Uh, oh wait, that's not... I, I, I thought that was another guy. There's a monstrous evil roaming the western desert. It's a huge tree. A tree that moves on its own, I tell ya. The mayor of Toku lives here. If you want to know about our plight, you should ask him. I'm the mayor of this town. We've been beset by soldiers coming from the western desert since the quake. They seized our food supply and captured our able-bodied citizens. This town is key is on its knees and there's nothing we can do to stop him. There's a hidden staircase at the heart of the that leads to the storeroom with a few uh, weapons and a few other things. We're a peaceful folk and no one's prepared to fight. Please take whatever you need to save our town. Well, say less. Um, what the hell did I just pick up? So I found Kempo Gi. Oh, oh. All right, cool. Um, anything else? Anything else you like? You want to share with the class, guys? Bookshelves. Okay. Well. Hmm. I know you're hiding things. Oh. Please, spare the child. What are you talking about? Oh, you're not with the soldiers? My apologies. I assume those brutes are back to finish what they started. They took my husband captive and headed west into the desert. They bore the crest of King Argus. I, I pray that my husband's unharmed. Uh, I'm going to assume that you, the rest of the items are like... You can pick them up when you, like, liberate the town, you know? Oh, hello, High Potion. These little dead ends are very telling that there's an item in there. 
I think. Like here, maybe? No, nope. right. there you go. Is that all? Yeah, cool. All right, let's go rescue those uh, captured people, I guess. Um, okay. I'm going to avoid that for now. Knocker. Ow. Man, that knocker hits hard. Ooh. What is this then? Living woods. Oh. The major changed the elder tree into a wandering creature can change his weakness. Only one only one who can see through his deception may be able to defeat him. The elder tree of the these woods were cursed and carved to the shape of a monstrous castle. Now it wanders the desert aimlessly. You must help. Have you heard of Hein? He uses the barrier shift spell to change his weakness. These woods are alive. We are the fairies who inhabit these woods. I heard the, the cries of the woods. They weep for the elder tree that has been made that has made these woods its home for thousands of years. For 10,000 years. But that great tree was cursed by a despicable mage and left the woods behind. Hein, the royal advisor of King Argus, is the one who cursed the elder tree to wander the land. Without the elder tree, these woods will soon perish. Our home, our friends, the trees will wither away. There's one item in here. Okay. Fairies, one of you, give me. All right. All right, fairies. You may not want to give me the item now, but I'll be back. I don't know how far and why is there something flying? That thing that's flying scares me. Oh, it's not flying, it's in the water. Oh, it's like the uh it's like the Midgard serpent. Well, I don't believe this. It. Wait, so I need to get here. Maybe I was thinking, right? If there's if there's no item around, around here, um, no, there has to be an item here, right? This, this place feels like it's too small to not have an item. Uh, one item. Alright, I'll come back for it. But I'll make a safe state just in case. I guess we go to the, um, to the, um, we go 
and try to avoid that elder tree. It seems like what they're saying is that you can't uh, hit the elder tree at the moment. So you gotta like break the spell, which means um, looking for this guy called Hein. Which I'm uh, I'm not too averse to doing right now. Let's go look for Hein. They say southwest. That's a uh, that's a, a, a village, right? Here, maybe. Oh, wait, what? It smells like chocobos. Oh, I'm gonna assume we need like the gears of green to like. Wait, what? I don't need it yet. I was just gonna go, um. I was just gonna go here, you know. Ah! I guess when you find a geese of green, you come back to the, um. to the, uh, the chocobo thing. Village of the Ancients. Cool. We are descendants of the Ancients. Shit creators of civilization as you know it. We live in harmony with nature, as is our creed. Who the hell is that? Also, one item. Cool. I dare you to circle the whole continent on a chocobo. I'll give you a prize if you do. The whole continent? Chocobo's nest in the forest due east of here. Have you been by any chance? I have. You know what? I'm going to circle the continent on the chocobo. You think I won't? What, what is it, a lap? Alright. Ah, oh, let's go! Look at this uh, like, giant, like, giant outer ring that we live on. And you know what? It's an excuse to listen to the chocobo music, which is great. I love the chocobo music, man. Anyway, this isn't like that far. We're already like halfway through. And it, it helps us like see things. Alright, so we So there is a, a place that we cannot go to, I guess. Cool. There's one cave here, which leads to another cave. Huh. How did we not see this then? Very weird. The map is a lot smaller than the others. Yeah, what now? Circle the entire place. You actually went and did it. You made it all the way around the continent on the chocobo. Here's your prize. The hell? And that's not even... Oh, that's not even the secret item. I was banking it on be, it being the secret item. I'm not going to lie. Wait, what? Oh, that's the secret item. So why is so are, are the, the two mithril swords I currently have equipped like super strong? It's because I can't equip them. All right. Hmm. 
I guess we might be sticking to Warrior for a bit. I really don't want to. Sight. Yo, Sight's a bullshit thing when you can just open the map. Wait, I'm looking for Hine. Light and dark are living forces. When the time is right, they choose four young heroes unto whom they bequeath their power. The warrior of dark were four such people, chosen to save the world from the wrath of light. But the balance has shifted once more, and it's up to you to restore the light. Do not abuse this awesome power. Thanks, old man. Okay. Um. Well, I guess there's nothing much here then. How much is it to like rest? Hundred twenty. What a scam. We'll see if the war if the warrior does like more damage than the onion knight. It should do. But I don't I don't want it to be like if it's like too not 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 too massive a difference. Then I don't care much for it. Alright, let's look for more. Okay, never mind, we're sticking to the warrior for a bit. That was a lot more. There's nothing here, though. Alright, before we do this, let's go. Before we fight the thing, I want to go up and see. Hermit. Those are terrifying. I don't like the look of it. Alright. Huh. What is this? Castle Argus. Hey, that's actually where we need to be. Right? Uh, hey. King Argus, what is this I hear about you attacking other people? 21 chests? Um... Is there no one here? I think I'll need a guide for this. I'm the king! The Gulgans are a sightless race. I hear they never leave their gulch. Are you, is that what you're trying to tell me to go to? The Gulgans? That's absolutely nothing here. So who are the Gulgans? I'm gonna assume that I can't do everything until with the uh, with that with that tree until I um until I finish up this area anyway. What is that? It's a tornado. Look. Hour of Owen. Who's Owen? Brock? Oh, I've been silenced. Hmm. 
nine chests. All right, let's do this first then. Ooh, it's a good thing as well that they silence Dark instead because um, he doesn't he doesn't care. Any secret item? No. No. What? Maybe we have to become frogs first. Okay, so we, we're not allowed to come here in the first then. I'm guessing we need to get the toad spell. Huh. Weird. Okay. Well, this is a no-go then. What about here? Knocker! Man, seems like Luna doesn't do s massive damage against some of them, you know? Oh, hang on, this was... Yeah! Golden Clutch Gulch? This is Golgan Gulch. You should know that we Golgans are born sightless. However, we make up for our lack of vision with a sixth sense. Some of our kind can even see the future. We serve the Wind Crystal, a source of light, and that whose power has been bestowed upon you. Henceforth, you must go to the crystals of fire, water, and earth. They will grant you greater power than you already possess. The Great Earthquake was only the beginning. The tremors tore the land asunder. The crystal source of the world's light was swallowed into the depths as monsters emerged from the chasm now scouring the earth. Yet, that was nothing compared to the catastrophe to come. I see a future of both light and darkness, but this is by no means set in stone. Have you heard of Shadowbringers? The living woods, the sentient forest, calls to you. Okay, cool, same thing. We stay sequestered away in this gulch, for those who know the future should not dare to influence fate. When crimson flames threaten the tower's destruction, he who alters fate's course will awaken to his destiny. This really is Shadowbringers, man. It's all, it's, it's all Shadowbringers like dialogue. The Earth's power sealed away in the other three sources of light. The cri Earth crystal may have been sealed in a similar fashion. I've been expecting you. Take this spell and use it to enter the Tower of Elwyn to the north. Your de destiny awaits you there, Dash. Okay, cool. Weird, but okay. Alright, I guess we did go a long way around for the wrong path. And I'm assuming there's three chests here? Hey yo, old man, what you hiding? <laughs> there we go. I'm sorry I pilfered your stuff. Did you actually take my shit? What the hell is wrong with you? It's a good thing we checked. Alright, Tower of Owen. Okay, but what's in this one? Not chocobo wood. I I don't wanna do the chocobo wood. I don't wanna ride the chocobos because uh I wanna pick up the I wanna pick up like like um, enemies that I may have missed, you know? Are you serious? There's no I just had to say something. Yo, what has gotten into Ignis? He is swiping.
All right, Tara of Owen. Do I think we safe? I think we safe. Something tells me I gotta go to the Tower of Owen. That guy's right about me. My destiny's waiting for me there. You are actually a frog. Okay. Um, okay. Magic. Alright, we need to save one level two spell. Alright, we're frogs now. Let's get going. Welcome to the Tower of Owen. I hope you like it here. For it will be your final resting place. This place looks familiar. And you know what? At, at least we don't have to be frogs the entire time. Which is good. Alright, ju just look for chest. All mechanical stuff, very strange. Oh. I thought you could just walk across that. Hmm. Cool, alright. Alright, not nothing here. If I see a boss, I'll just be sure to like make sure. He he he. Wait, I remember. I'm an ancient. So uh, as long as we have all nine chests before we get to the boss, we're fine. Harfing. What is that? Oh, it's a weapon. Apparently not that good. Or is it on? It might be only be a red mage uh, weapon. In that case, that's fine. Your soul shall wander these sodden halls forever. I remember now. There's a hidden switch on the fifth floor. It's on the eighth section of the wall from the left. Eighth section from the wall to the left. We're here on the fifth floor. Okay, well... Count it. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, it, it counts the uh, the blank wall as well. I just thought it was the gears. That's okay. How many more do we need? Six more. Just use your map and you'll never get lost. Two. Two, two, two. Also, the, whatever we just gave Ignis, he is slapping these monsters really hard with his stabs. Yeah, even Raphia's hitting them hard. What, five more? No, three more? No, four more.
We haven't um, seen a chest that's got monsters in them, though. Maybe that's for the better, you know? Probably good that we haven't gotten ambushed yet. Three more. Uh, Alright, there you go, three. Flame mail. Salaman sword, salmon sword. Cool. Oh no, my mortal enemy, poison. Gorgon. I, Medusa, will destroy this tower in the name of Xander. The continent will plummet from the from its place in the skies. <laughs> you will not need to fear. Now die. That is freaky looking. Wow. Oh, wow. I wonder. There we go. Too easy. Too easy. I gotta check the reactor. The flames lick and flare wildly. An explosion looks imminent. No, don't go near it. I remember now. I'm one of the remaining ancients, the watchman of this tower. I was only it, I was only supposed to awaken if something happened to the tower. But I was asleep for so long my memories were scrambled. When I woke up, I forgot my purpose. This doesn't look good. I think I know how to stabilize the flames, but I can only do it from inside the reactor. I have no choice. The tower is the only thing keeping the continent afloat. If it blows, we'll fall right out of the sky. This is farewell. Thank you for your help. No, stop, Des, you'll die! This is my destiny. Don't worry, once I repair the furnace, that whirlpool should stop. Uh, then... You can search for the Dwarven Island. That's where you'll find the fire crystal. Once I'm in, I'll warp you to all outside. It's been a blast. Literally. Now then, here we go. Dash. Resuming the everyone dies from FF2. No, not another one.